Got a minute? Oh! What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Gwen, how did, how did she... How, how did you get... How have you been? Uh, it's a long story. Is this the room you grew up in? Uh, it, it is. But uh, my, my dorm room is very adult. Right. No, of course. Hey! Are these your drawings? What? No, oh, no. good. <sighs> I missed you too. Okay. So, what are you doing here? I, I mean, I, th I thought I'd never see you again. Wanna get out of here? I'm grounded. Bummer. What? Is Spider-Man grounded? Um, uh, I mean, I... Trident is the only way back, but it is guarded by the Caress. The creature from our legends is real. You're ready. Atlantis has always had a king. Now I need something more. A hero. King fights only for his nation, you fight for everyone. Rightful king of Atlantis, son of a human father, queen of the seas.
There are things out there in the universe you're better off not knowing about. This is one fight you won't win. I have a plan. Every citizen is born exactly as designed. Adam. It's the next step in our evolution. This might be dangerous, so let's put on our mean faces. This is the end. Tell me something. You can go anywhere you want, right? Any timeline, any universe. Why do you want to stay and fight to save this one? You change the future. And you change the past. Are you in? You are a hard man to kill. The name is Kang the Conqueror. There's so much we didn't know about this place. World of the world. Entire civilizations. Far more than we ever theorized. Disruption in the space-time continuum destroyed my reality. What has become of my city? What has become of its heroes? So you find yourself trying to remember the things that made you happy. But slowly, your brain begins to erase every memory that ever brought you joy. That's how it starts. The fever. The rage. Feeling of powerlessness that turns good men. Open the door! Do not open that door. Cruel. Sometimes I feel like I've already seen everything that's gonna happen. Peter, what's going on? I have this noise in my head. How do I turn back the darkness? Without losing myself to it.
always known that this was how things were supposed to end, but I wasn't made to realize it. I love to move fast and speed of any kind. I think that that's because I grew up the daughter of a great fighter pilot, and every day I would wake up and go outside and look up and see my father and his squadron taking off and their F-4s roaring across the sky, and it was the most thrilling thing still I've experienced in my entire life. So when he lost his life in service to this country, I, it ignited a desire to, in me to turn all of that tragedy and thrill into one day making the greatest fighter pilot movie of all time. But try as I might and look as I did, I couldn't find the right story ever. I kept looking and looking, but I just couldn't find the right one until now. Now I found a movie about two things I love. So I'm gonna see you very soon.